Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome to Hotfix. So today we're going to talk about uh, fake gamers. Mr. Kirioff, that's all we're going to talk about. Because I, I, uh, this, I just, there's certain people who need to be punched in the mouth, sir. Multiple times. Pissed in action. Back and forth, back and forth, back <laughs> and forth. Pissed in action. <laughs> <laughs> so, no doubt you've seen the, uh, uh, the VGAs. And there was a woman, Alison somebody or other, I don't really care for a name, who called Mr. Gabe Gary, which is quite bad. So, okay, maybe it was a slip of the tongue on the stage. We don't know. But let's be honest, Gabe is a pretty unique figure. So, you know, it, in his body I'm talking about, not as in like a public figure, he looks pretty unique. He's also you know, quite a unique like, figure in terms of... stone frame. Well, yeah, there's <laughs> yeah. that. But also, so, you, I, don't think, I don't think anyone's ever sort of... I mean, I, I personally have never thought to myself, oh, now who's the guy who, who, who's the head of Valve? What's his name? Oh, Gary, 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 Gary something. No, it, it, Valve, Gabe. It's not even <laughs> Maybe difficult. thinking about Gary's mod, but even then, that would not be... No. I mean, Gary's a bloke from <laughs> Warsaw. <laughs> He's quite near us, so if you're listening, Gary, you should probably aim. But if you are, I love your work. Um, so, then this, uh, this woman goes onto Twitter and says, Hey, Gabriel Newell, which is not his Twitter account. So this is even more retarded. So sorry, I had a brain fart and called you Gary. I must now revoke my gamer card, off to bake something and play with dolls. Okay, so I went to this woman's website and I was assaulted with all kinds of crap on her about page. About playing Zelda and other, uh, let's say, hip, well-known gaming franchises from sub-2000, the year 2000 this is, on various gaming systems which these people would have grown up with. Um, and so that to them... Or, well, to be honest, they've just looked at Reddit. They've looked at Reddit gaming and seen that every day. There's a thousand posts of uh, Zelda, of God knows what on there. So therefore, Mario and Zelda are the best things to have ever existed, ever. And therefore, because they played them, they are gamers. And then they will use this to go around and pretend they are gamers to get gigs like the absolutely dog shit awful uh, Video Game Awards, which is, which is terrible, by the way, Mr. Kirioff. I, this is going to turn into a rant on game gaming award shows as well. I, I just because I hate them. I just want to chip in just quickly, right? I just want to. You want I to donate cash to me? We'll do I it. Then, bro. Do it. <laughs> I do not give a fuck if you've played Zelda. I don't give a Zelda. fuck if you've played oh. Mario. I could not give the number of fucks I could give about the fact that you've still got a NES in your fucking attic is somewhat less than zero. I don't care. The whole thing of oh oh I'm a game I'm a hardcore gamer I'm an old school gamer I played Zelda. Who gives a fuck? The, I mean, <laughs> all, and also I mean this extends to so many things. All the fucking nostalgia attack posts all over Reddit. All the things of I'm doing <laughs> my Reddit hate. hate well, no, well, also all the things of I'm doing my 89th playthrough of the Ocarina of Time on YouTube. I don't <laughs> care. Fuck off. For God's sake, I mean, why are you still playing these games? Okay, they were good, but you do know that there are more things out there in the world for you to experience. There are new games. If you go to a thing new? called Steam, there's fucking thousands of new games that you could be playing. You could you could forego that 120th playthrough of Super Mario Brothers. Playthrough? What's wrong Playthrough. I'm getting stressed out. I can't... It's just... Don't, don't you like Mario, bloke? Don't, don't you like... Mario's a cunt. A Fuck Mario. Mario. <laughs> I just, oh, it's, I just it's don't understand. It's a boring It's a spicy meatball. I just it's don't. It's me. A Mario. There's this whole thing of, oh, yeah, the, the real gamers, they played these things. Yeah, they might have played them once, <sighs> but it's not like, it's not like there's nothing me? else to talk I, about. I, is I, that, <laughs> yeah, I, I get what you're saying. What annoys me is, the whole thing of like, um, you know how recently... Uh, the nerd culture, shall we say, has become a hip thing to be part of. It's sort of like a extension of that. Well, I, I like games. I'm a gamer. It's like, well, yeah, okay. Um, now, this is kind of weird, considering the situation I'm in. But I would not class myself as a nerd or a geek or anything like that. I enjoy games on the computer and I operate a YouTube channel and spend most of my day on the computer. So you would be, you'd be like, well, you're stupid, Stylo, so of course you are. But I'm, I'm not. At least I don't view myself as this. I'm somebody who enjoys games and knows quite a lot of game, a, a lot about games, just like Mr. Kirio. And we play masses of games, masses and masses of games. I don't go around and proclaim I am a gamer to people. It's it's just like a job hobby. It's not it's not like yeah, I'm a 
gamer. Oh my god. I can't, I can't handle it. This seems to be like, this. It's oh, like a, it's shit. the thing of using it as an identifier, isn't it? It's like uh, at one at one point, I very I liked uh, I liked cycling, and I would go and do off road cycling. I did not go up to people and go, "I'm an off road biker." I mean, you don't do that. It's like why is gaming the only hobby where people feel the need to go up to someone they've never met in a group situation? I mean, it's like, oh, so what do you do for? Fun? I'm a gamer. I play games. It, great. <laughs> you don't say I go and watch a million films at the cinema every month. You do, <laughs> you don't. It's not like. <laughs> It's I read you books. Do. It's Boss, not something you. you are. I mean, you could be inspired I, I by it and stuff, but for God's sake, I'll read the fucking Horus Heresy books. I don't call myself a goddamn space marine. What the fuck is... <laughs> <laughs> Although there's pictures of you as a space marine all over the channel. So don't lie to me, and me as well. <laughs> <laughs> this is getting bad. But but listen, I'm irritated by these... these uh, it's so false. Like, But these people often have got quite a big following of people who are not actually gamers but kind of wannabe so to me to even use the term gamer it sounds ridiculous to me but it's like oh look so and so is a gamer you know like when you get a minor celebrity who presents i don't know some sort of the, the uk baftas or whatever i mean who, who did that the gaming baftas was it um it was that celebrity wasn't it ed Byrne did it last time i think did he yeah the guy from mock the week did it as well didn't he oh yeah uh, daro breen did it yeah 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 the irish guy so, but it's like, what are they actually, uh, you know, what are they doing? Um, it, you know, uh, this is going off at a tangent, but at the weekend, Manchester United played Manchester City. Yeah, big football game. It was immense as well. It was quite the game of the season. However, have a guess who's there? Tom Cruise. So Sky are interviewing Tom Cruise, yeah? Now, Tom Cruise clearly knows nothing about football, right? So he's just giving generic <laughs> bullshit answers that are like cringeworthy. And doing a stupid Tom Cruise stupid smile. As if that's enough to answer a question. Well, i got news for you, Mr. Cruise. It isn't enough, yeah? So then he goes out and starts fondling the pitch going, Oh, after, after he says, mind you, yeah, that um, he's been watching English football since the 80s. This probably means he's seen a game in the 80s or a bit of a match. So this means he's watched it since the 80s. However, he, he proclaims to know loads about Premier League football and all this crap. And uh, it, it, it's it's... It's quite a thing. We had a bit of a break up there, team speak. You're back, Mr. Kirio. I am. I have returned. Good Lord. I have returned. So, what did you what did you catch there at the end of that? <laughs> um, I, Tom I Cruise heard, rant. Yeah, I heard Tom Cruise, and that obviously knows nothing about football. And uh, I, I agreed. What? Okay, so basically, what happened was he uh, um, claimed he knows about English football, or he knows about English football, but yada 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 and all that shit. Um, he goes out onto the pitch and he touches the pitch and then he says to the, the guy interviewing him, oh, but the pitch was a bit damp, but then I know it's a bit damp up here in the north of England. And I'm thinking, no, the pitch is damp because they pre-watered the pitch to make the ball move faster around the pitch, you stupid fuck! This just shows that they don't understand what's going on. And to me, these are the worst kind of people who pretend they know what they're doing when they don't know anything anyway. They're just doing it for personal gain, basically. Oh! So I'm a gamer. I'm going. To, I don't know why I keep doing an American accent, but I'm, it's an awesome accent. I'm sure you'll, you'll agree. <laughs> I'm a gamer. I don't believe this. Oh my god! I'm doing a, a, an award show. Hello, Gary. Oh, you're the best, Gary. Oh, 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 oh. Your name's Gabe. Oh god. Uh, oh, I didn't know who you were. I only play Zelda. Do you play Zelda, Gabe? I mean, Christ <laughs> Almighty. So look, 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 Mr. Kirioff. I got problems with this. And I know you've got problems with this. And I'm guessing people in the comments have got problems with this. So what I want to know is instances where you've come across people who know shit all but pretend to know it all. <laughs> Link me to people who are absolutely cringeworthy in the, the, to the highest degree. Uh, or people that are just trying to bounce off the whole, I'm a gamer. So I'm going to try and use this as some sort of, I don't know, backdoor into Hollywood. It makes me sick, bro. I'm not happy about this. I'm actually going to have to go and throw up into a bucket. Because, listen, I'm not a gamer, but I am. <laughs> so you see we've got identity problems here. I hate the phrase. A gamer. It, uh, the way it's used, frankly, in, in terms of things like, like YouTube and, and... This is and why just, I think I don't like it. And like, like, so I guess it's like new media, isn't it? It's like, if, if, you want to be, if you want to be cool, if you want to be in, you've got to be a gamer. And the majority of... of there are just too many instances of people who aren't fucking gamers, who don't play games. I'm just going to throw this out there as well. A lot of these uh, fake gamers, Mr. Kirioff, appear to be female. I'll just leave that there. 
That's uh, I mean, I'm, that's rather. I don't know why I'm so close to the mic. It is controversial. But controversial. what I'm saying, I'm not, I'm not being a, uh, abusive to women. I'm just saying, you know, what assets do they have? I don't know what is what, what are, who are the majority of the people on the internet? What sex are they, Mister Kirill? That's what I mean. I'm not saying women are retards because they're not. Women are cleverer than me. <laughs> I'll be the first to admit it. But yeah, that's all I want to say. Now I'm going to step back from the mic. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, that's that's basically the gist of it. It's just that the gamer is Miss mis- Kirioff, mis- I often wonder I often wonder oh. if I had booby boobies and a fanny fanny. And that's not an arse, you Americans, it's a fanny, it's a bit of the front. I'd have the millions of subscribers on YouTube. <laughs> 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 the bit at the front. The I'm now gonna step away from the mic again. Good lord. But, oh. It's it's a fair question. <laughs> it's a fair question. <laughs> I get away from the mic. <laughs> So it is, Mr. Kirioff. So, basically, I'm going to stop saying basically, but I just don't like, I don't like it, Mr. Kirioff. I just do not like it. No, there's a connotation. If you enjoy games and you know about them and you're knowledgeable, then I've got respect for you. If you are trying to move in the gaming circles for, to try and advance some sort of career or something, it really annoys me down to the core. And I... I'm not going to slanderise people and throw names around, but I'd like for you guys to do that instead. <laughs> Put them in the comments below. See, I'll say if you uh, play, if you actually play games, if you, if you, if your way of relaxing, if your thing of doing things when you, something you enjoy is playing a game, fine. If you played Zelda when you were eight and you've not touched a game <laughs> since, fuck it's up. It's a bit Mario. Just, uh, that kind of thing is just stupid. I mean, I, I once pressed a key on a piano. I'm not a fucking pianist. It's not. It's the same thing. If you've once played a game and then you never touched it again, but now you go around and say, I'm a gamer because I played Zelda. You're an idiot. You're not a gamer. You're an absolute twat. And here's Fuck a off. bombshell. Zelda is shit. <laughs> <laughs> I don't even like Zelda. You know, I don't even like Mario. Do you know why? Because they're terrible. And I've got really close to the mic and I'm shouting, so I need to go back into radio voice. So I don't like Mario. I don't like Zelda. Mario Kart was elite though on the SNES, but now I think it's Mario Kart 15, uh, and it's probably the same game. Although that's a wild assumption, but I would imagine it is because I look at Nintendo and I don't like them as well, <laughs> right? And I look at them and I'm like, you just make the same uh, games over and over again, lads. You seem to be it's, it, absolutely raping Mario and Sonic Mario. for all they're worth. Mostly Mario. It's Sonic. I mean, is he even? He ain't even Nintendo. Is he? What are you dribbling about, well, boy? Sega. Sonic, get with same the, difference. Get with the, get with the, but, you call yourself a gamer. <laughs> I don't care about Sega, what they ever fucking made. Um, <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, I mean, Mario, by now, I, I can only assume that he's got an arse like a wizard sleeve at this point. <laughs> I mean, it's just terrible. What was you it? Can you imagine Mario Luigi Olympics looking on? 2012. Not that again. was a fucking Not game, again. wasn't it? <laughs> oh, probably. <laughs> So yeah, basically, fake games are shit, Mario shit, Zelda shit. Let us know in the comments, people know. are shit. <laughs> this has probably been the best uh, hotfix video I've ever seen, or ever made, ever had the pleasure of being part of. So, Mr. Kirioff, I'll, uh, if, if the people would like to follow me on Twitter, I am at Unit Lost Gaming, and Mr. Kirioff is... At Kirioff. Good lord. And uh, we'll catch you next time. Toodaloo! You fake gamers. Ha <laughs> ha!